Imo people continue to observe the stay at home order by the state government with total shutdown on commercial activities in the state. Imo people no doubt have been faced with several challenges, a situation which the state government is not ignorant of. In view of this, the state government recently distributed relief materials to all the 27 local government areas of the state with a cash support of 100,000 naira to each INEC ward in the state. In his speech at Imo International Convention Center (ICC), the venue of the event, the state governor, Senator Hope Zarema, said the program was designed to provide palliative measure to the sufferings of Imo people occasioned by the measures put in place by his administration to prevent COVID-19 from entering the state. The governor stated that the distribution of the food items would pass through the Interim Management Committee chairman to the 305 wards of the state and all the chairman to ensure that the items get to the targeted people who were ordered to stay at home. Is I using you, the TC chairman? As arrowhead, you must carry along all government appointees. Of course, the House of Assembly members, they are part of government. They must participate with you people to do this work. Ensure that the new spirit will drive this exercise. And whatever report that will come back after will be treated as appropriate. You must remove any sign of, of greed, no matter how little. Give this to make sure that the poor people, the common people, that are not able to come out, get this thing. This is the first example. So for me and for you, it is a test. So go there and do what exactly that is contained in this template. Local government by local government. Governor Zerema, who appreciated President Mohamed Buhari's effort through the Ministry of Humanitarian Affairs, also thanked donor agencies, corporate organizations, and well meaning individuals for their support to the state government. I must thank Mr. President, the President of Nigeria, for all his support and effort through the Ministry of Humanitarian Services. They provided stellar loads of rice to Imo State tomato and other food items. I will also commend the Controller General of Customs, who also supported the Presidential Task Force on COVID-19 with a lot of food items. What we have done is to purchase, we procured more items to augment what federal government and other donor agencies, corporate organizations and well-meaning individuals from Imo State donated to our state. We were able to augment this thing so that it will be able to go around. Some of the IMC chairmen lauded the state government's initiative and promised to distribute the items in line with the governor's directive. I'm so happy and I believe my people from my local government, they will, they will be happy by the time we take the relief materials back home. At least the US lesson has proven that he loves his people, he has interest of people at heart. For local government, I have uh, 35 communities and uh, I have uh, leaders in the various 35 file GAs. Knowing fully well that the governor is going to do a thing like this, I've kept my people that is drawing names of the indigents in the various communities. Once I get home today, I'll begin to dispatch. With the effort made so far by the state government in combating the spread of COVID-19 in the state, Imo people are enjoined to pray and support the administration with the hope that there will be light at the end of the tunnel.